<clears throat> okay, hello, and God bless everybody. <clears throat> um, getting more deeper into this late hour now, and yeah, as, as the Lord said, everything's coming abroad, and everybody's seeing things more clearly. Who who is who? Everybody is. Um, it's a mixed bag, you know. And a lot of it is the uh, what the, the knowledge, what people have been taught in this world. That's why I say it's a mixed bag. Um, and few people, you know. What I look at is where the scriptures, it says, uh, uh, because you believe not the truth. Okay. And I, and I believe the reason why they don't believe the truth is because they don't know the Bible. They haven't read it, you know, and they say they know and see the times, but they haven't taken the time to read it because who's warning them? Nobody is. There's a lot of ear ticklers just telling them what they, you know, all you got to do is believe and that's it, you know, and faith and grace and that's it. But, you know, Jesus says a lot more than that. He says his word has to bite in you. He says you have to die to this world. And and blessed are those who overcome, okay? Overcome what? This world. And how do we do that? Through Christ, you know? You will receive a crown of life. Um, there's also that part where, you know, some have 30, some have 60, some have 100. 100, 60, 30. You know, so, I mean, how is it all going to work out in the wash? I don't know. I really don't know, but I do I do know very few people are going to make it out of this. And I know there's a lot of ear tickling going on. And the scripture is warning you about ear tickling. And they're not teaching the, uh, you guys see that? They're not teaching the uh, gospel. Um, this is what's going on, you know. That was definitely a spirit, man. Came right in around two two minutes. Um, they're all around here, you guys. It's everywhere. This place is, uh, it's like infested, you know? It's a spiritual war. Anyhow, that's why everybody's at wherever they're at, you know? It's a mixed bag. And uh, I came in over at this place here. I haven't been here in a long time. Had breakfast. And uh, man, when I walk in there, man, it's like really changed. Even the people inside there, you know, you could, <laughs> it's a different spirit. You know, they don't want to hear anything that you got to say. They know what I'm going to say already, but they don't want to hear it. And uh, a lot of people have changed. Some of the, like the one person that sat me, she, uh, I remember talking to her a while back and she was like, yeah, she believes and she sees and, but this time when I walked in, it was like, you know, didn't want to, you know, don't talk about it, you know. Don't talk about it. And I think it's just more so the people. All the people that you're around, you know. This place is in utter darkness, man. Make no mistake about it. Um, our hope and our faith is in the Lord Jesus Christ. And we know we're saved by grace through faith. In the Lord, God quickened us in with Christ. But he also opened our eyes and gave us an understanding. And we see God's work at everything that he's doing. We know everything's coming abroad. Uh, so he makes it to where we can tell who's who around us. Even though they might profess, but we know by what they do. You know? Okay, you guys, be strong in the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ.